It's called the BookBot. Also known as the Automated Storage and Retrieval System, the new robot stores about 1.1 million of the university's library books. The process begins when you request a book from the online library catalog. If the book can be retrieved from the BookBot, it will have a label that says BookBot or Stacks if it is to be received from the shelf. You then press the Request button and a signal is sent to the BookBot to retrieve the book from its respective bin to bring it down to staff members to scan and put on a shelf to await pickup. And returning the book is as easy as a quick scan and the click of a mouse button. Sophomore Nick Palumba is a student who works with the BookBot. He says most of the challenges he faces are from human error. You know, you push a wrong, wrong button and the book bot does something that you were not expecting, like take it to one of the other lanes, not the one that you're in. Students at Temple say the book bot is an attraction. Temple's becoming really popular because of the book bot. Actually, my sister is an alumni from Temple University and she came here just to see the book bot. I think it is very innovative. And it's a step in the right direction for artificial intelligence. Temple University Head of Access and Media Services Justin Hill says in planning the design, the main purpose of the BookBot was to create more space. We wanted to super condense the footprint the collection itself holds within the building, which allows us to have more programmable space and the ability to have co-location of academic services.